We start with the. Hang on. Alright, there we go. No more interruptions now. We start with the CD. There it is. Here's the back. There's all the songs. I mean, the, the songs of Fronte here are from in the movie. These are singles. And you have that documentary. Here's the disc. Another part of the phone album. In fact, the first eight albums were on part of the phone. And here's the book. Lit, whatever you want to call it. Front the back, there's a picture. From the movie, I guess. Then there's John wearing glasses, although not the glasses he wore before uh, they stopped touring. I'm not gonna describe it. Although there's them in the studio. There's George with his guitar, and there's John, Paul, George, and Ringo. These are, I'm guessing, are from the shoot. There's another picture of them starting to run, and there's them running. Run, 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 run. No, I think it goes run, 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 run. Yeah, that's the song from the MacBook Pro commercial. So, put that there. And here's the mono version of the album. All these things look like you get ripped them off, but I don't like it. Here, so there's the fur again. And I should, and I should start showing the sides now. Yeah, you know, here, the, here they are. If the camera can focus. Focus, camera. Oh. Here's the... Here's the CD. The mono CD, that is. Like all the mono CDs, they're made from Japan. Right there. Yeah, I'll put that back together when I'm done. Now here's the US version of Our Day's Night. And it's different. You have four photos in the front. And 5, 10, 15, 20 photos on the UK version. And there's a little fact about this. All US albums also had mono and stereo copies. And all stereo ones say stereo on it. This one says stereo on it. And there's a different version of the US version of Hard Day's Night, which is in mono. But they don't show this. And that picture will be shown right now. So yeah, there it is. Here's the back. And here, let me open this so I can describe more of it. Here's the 
And the U.S. version of A Hard Day's Night, the album, it was made by United Artists Records. And it kind of imitates the front cover. But this side has 15 photos. Yeah, and this one's red, this one's blue, and my favorite color is blue. Although some pe if people ask me my favorite color, I'm just going to lie and say it's red. Yeah, and this also imitates this, but these are still from the movie. And here's the track listing. It has all songs from the movie and foreign instrumental songs, which are I Should Have Known Better and I Love Her, Ringo's Theme, and A Hard Day's Night. And there's all songs from the movie, plus All Cry Instead, which was printed as I Cry Instead. And did you know that the U.S. version of all, uh, I Cry Instead or All Cry Instead is longer than the U.K. one? Cause because the UK one is edited down to a minute and something seconds. I don't know why they can show how many minutes the song was on the U U mono or stereo one. And this one, and I cry instead is edit is edited to two minutes and six seconds. You can see right there. Now, All Cry Instead is on the soundtrack, but not in the film. Because it was going to be in the, in the film, but I think his director, Richard Lester, didn't think it was strong, so he just replaced it with Can't Buy Me Love. Here's the CD. It has both mono and stereo on it. And here's a little surprising fact. I never owned any of the U.S. copies. I only owned the U.K. copies, which are good in my opinion. And then, and when I get done filming, I'm filming, I'm gonna take a break for a little bit and then film my review of Rubber Soul. Yeah, yeah, because I haven't reviewed Rubber Soul yet. This is just a re-review. And by re-review, I mean it's a it's a review that I'm showing again. This is something new, something new. And just because it's a stereo on there, look, all the CDs of the U.S. versions on CD, they both have modern stereo, so whatever, you know. And that's the songs from Hard Day's Night. I don't know why they put it, those songs on there. And it has also some extracts from Hard Day's Night, which are Things we said today, anytime at all, when I get home, that's it. And the other ones, which are You Can't Do That and I'll Be Back, You Can't Do That, was on The Beatles' second album, which I reviewed on my review with The Beatles, and I'll Be Back is on the US album Beatles 65, and that's the one I'll be reviewing when I review Beatles for Sale. You know, I'm gonna cut the video and move the CDs aside. Okay, but the CDs move, move aside, I can finally show you guys the movie. This is just a version that I have. I never owned the one where it has a slide out thing or the one like this, but it's in a box. I just own the single CD one. No, DVD one. Now there was an event here in the state that I live where they showed the movie but you can sing along and I and yes I did go to that and I do not want to show you but I will not show you guys the ticket because I have the place address on there so I don't want to leave that. Here's the movie. Bring it up close for you. Uh, car. Uh, Criterion Collection, however you pronounce that. And it came with this thing, which is not a book. Because if it was, it only has two pages, it's a flip out. And I'll show you the back of it first. Yeah, I'll go from here to here. Okay, now here's the other side. 
other side. Yeah, I'm not gonna read all of that. Because I don't want to bore you guys. Okay, now we can show off the vinyl. This is a stereo vinyl. I do not know. I do not own any mono vinyl besides the white album, but I already showed you that. I think I would. I think the only. I don't know which albums I would own in mono. I I only like stereo. There's the four pictures from the movie. There's the track listing. Then the other side. And we can get to the vinyl itself. And I'll stereo and say stereo on them. Like I already said. You know, put it in the light. Wait, but on this side, you can see the lines, but when you put the light on it, it's a bit lighter. Yeah, whoa, whoa, whoa. That was kind of cool. Well, let me do something. Okay, well, I'm not going to do that again because I don't want to break the thing. Yeah. No, it has a few carpet on it. I don't have a thing they can use for writer records that you can get from. Okay, I'll dust the rest off later because I don't want to make this video long. Alright, so that was our day's night. So, since I said I was going to film Rubber Soul after this, is what I'm going to do is uh, I'll go upload the video, but you're seeing it on YouTube. And then I'll take a little break. Then I'll come back and film Rubber Soul. And the reason I say that you're watching it on YouTube because I'm recording right now, but you're seeing this on off YouTube. Alright, so see you guys.